This is Jim Smith of Golden Real Estate. Today we're looking at 13932 West Virginia Drive in the Green Mountain section of Lakewood. This is a what I like to call a cul-de-sac neighborhood because you can see there's no traffic here at all except the residents who come and go. The view of the mountains to the west here. And it's just a really peaceful neighborhood with of well-kept homes. And look at this nice landscaping here. It's This is a three-bedroom, four if you count a, a non-conforming bedroom in the basement, but this is a three-bedroom house and two of the bedrooms open onto that deck. We'll see it upstairs, but that's the deck above the garage. Look at this nice landscaping here. And the backyard is just as nice. Really beautiful home. Let's go inside and look at this home. Coming in through the front door, we're initially on a parquet floor and next to the kitchen, which has a ceramic tile floor. I call this a, a country kitchen. And the main reason I do that is because of this nice eating area here with the built-in bench, benches on two sides. And there's the kitchen itself showing a nice pantry there. Window looking out over the front yard. Here's the, this could be considered a dining room if you wanted a dining room. It's uh, separated by one step down from the living room, or maybe we should call this a family room. Has a nice fireplace, wood burning fireplace there. Ceiling, which is vaulted. And then right here is a sunroom with a hot tub and that leads out to the backyard which I'll show you in a moment. Notice the wood ceiling and the skylights, wood walls. It's got uh, double pane windows so it really is an all season room. Coming back in, let's go upstairs and look at the uh, bedrooms here. It's a tri-level so a half flight up are the three bedrooms. Here's one of the guest bedrooms. I mentioned that the bedrooms, both that both the guest bedrooms access this really nice deck overlooking the front yard. Notice the hard floor. Here's the other guest bedroom, also with a hardwood floor opening to the deck. Here's the guest bathroom. It's a full bath, tub shower. And here's the master bedroom. Nice size master bedroom overlooking the backyard. Here's a large walk-in closet with a vanity in it leading to the three-quarter bath. There's a shower in there, which I won't show you. But that's the three-quarter bath and walk-in closet. And there's a second closet here. Now let's go down and look at the lower level, which is a half flight below the main level. In the lower level now, this is the door to the garage. There's a doggy door in it and then another doggy door to the outdoors. So if you had a dog, you could, it could make it all the way to the backyard that way. This is not just a powder room, but a three-quarter bath. Here is the laundry, and here is, uh, I guess, a second family room or rec room with window to the backyard, windows to the backyard. And down here is the basement. In the basement now, this is where the furnace and air conditioner are. And you can see the air conditioning system there. Here's the hot water heater. So that's the mechanical room, but here, the rest of this basement is a craft room, multi-purpose room, whatever you want to call it, with this uh, wood paneling and, and window wells. This could be a bedroom, but it's definitely non-conforming. There's a closet there, and there's a window well there. So that's the basement. Now let's go out and look at the backyard. Coming from the sunroom into the backyard, you're first on a covered portion of the deck, a very nice place for sitting in the shade. And here's a, an uncovered portion of the deck, great for barbecuing. 
and let me show you the landscaping of the backyard. It's got this retaining wall that goes around the entire backyard where there's a slope up to the back property line covered with fresh cedar and here's the backyard. Here's a gate to the to the front and there's a door to the garage there that the with a doggy door in it. But just notice how quiet it is here. This is a really quiet neighborhood. The loudest thing I hear is a jet that's probably 20,000 feet up in the air. That's it. Let's go back inside, out front, and wrap it up. Thanks for touring this fine green mountain home with me. If you'd like to see it in person, it would be my pleasure to show it to you. You can reach me anytime on my cell phone at 303-525-1851. Or you can email me at jim at goldenrealestate.com. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.